You know, one thing that a lot of people don't do as often as they should, and I don't do it sometimes, is check their leader whenever you're catching these trout. Mm -hmm. How often do you check yours? I try to check it after, at least after every every two or three fish. Yeah, yeah, every two or three fish. You know, speckled trout have got have got teeth, sharp teeth, and we use 20 pound Berkeley trialene for the leader. But even as tough as this line is, it's going to get frayed up. And you may or may not be able to see that, but there's a there's a lot of frays right here from these trout we've been catching. You can run your finger across it and feel them. If you feel that, you need to cut it off and retie it because the last thing you want to do is lose a good quality fish because you were lazy. Cut them off, retie it, you have a good solid knot, you have a good solid leader, and you'll land that next fish. What kind of knot are you using there? This here is your standard fisherman's knot. Run it through, wrap it around five times, back through the loop, and then through that one right there. Cinch it down. That's what I do with my monofilament. Mm -hmm. And whenever we get up into the uh, to the braid here, it's right. going to be a uni knot. Okay. I'll show you that on another tip. 